Greetings viewers and welcome to the La Winter Hotel Jomtian. Let's check out the room. A couple of things sort of um, made an impression on yours truly and uh, I've been in the room for a few hours. Um, I like the variety in the color scheme and in the furnishings in the room i'm liking the flooring it's really nice on the feet and i've already had a trial on the bed i've had a, a couple of hours kip this afternoon after some power tourism this morning and it's very comfortable and you get a great view of the uh, fantastic tv Another thing that made an impression was the Mr. and Mrs. or the Mrs. and Mr. cushions on the bed. Now, there is only one Mr. in this room and, uh, and that's how it will be. But um, there you go, if you have a visitor, I suppose. Um, it's interesting. And they say that um, which side of the bed you sleep on is generally uh, one you will favor for the rest of your life and uh, you can see here that I've automatically gone to the mister side but I think that's because it's adjacent to closest to to the window and the balcony so let's go and check that out and you can see here with the curtains drawn back that um, you get a lovely dare I say it sea glimpse of the ocean and um, it creates a, a feeling of a little bit more uh, space in the room as well and let's do the obligatory balcony check and it's uh, a Julie Antvelli, uh balcony here it's a very small one and you can see the air conditioning humming along there as well, the two air conditioning units. But you do get a nice view here. And in spite of the air conditioning noise, it is nice just to be able to step out on a balcony, in my opinion. You know, you get out of that cabin fever that you can have sometimes in a hotel room. You can see out there to the ocean, you can hear the promotional uh, van going down the second road there and more along the second road here as well. And, um, yeah we're not close we're close we're not super close we're close enough to the ocean uh, go across second road and down one of the soys there and you will be at the beach something uh, i'm already liking in this room as well another thing is um power points they're everywhere they are everywhere in this unit uh, sometimes you struggle um you know they might find one uh, I stayed in a hotel recently where there was two, but only one of them worked. If you're trying to charge up laptops, mobile phones, and other devices, it's good to have those extra power points. It's also nice to have a couple of different areas um, in terms of a, a settee. So, you know, I can sit down there, and I will very shortly, and finish my coffee. And you've got your little workstation there as well. And what about the bed? Well, I mentioned before, it's quite large. Um, and it's, um, you know, it's reasonably firm, but not too, not too firm. I did have a little, you know, little nap before, so it was very nice. And um, yeah, very, very pleased with a nice, good, sturdy bed, good sized. So storage and capacity uh, is more than ample. That is a big safety box there. There you go. Certainly fit my laptop in there. Heaps of room for uh, your favorite shirts, dresses, shorts, slacks, and others. 
You can see here the contrast, you've got the black, you've got the wood grain, you've got your sort of your marbly granite top there, um, and your yellow here, and it just um, gives this room a funky, modern kind of feel. So this place is pretty big on its branding. You've actually got your uh, complimentary waters uh, in sleeves, in their little sleeves there. Uh, and you've got your little coffee tea serving box also branded. Um, also branded is the little uh, storage and you've got here complimentaries. Coffee mate, Lipton teas, bit of Nescafe, bit of sugar. Uh, I've bought my own three in one for this um, afternoon brew as I do this vlog for you and for me. And just your standard little bar fridge. Uh, there's no um, mini bar in this room. And you know what, I don't mind that. Uh, mini bars can cause disputes. I've never had one myself, but I've been at reception checking into and out of hotels and I've overheard arguments over mini bars. So yeah, you can bring your own there if you like. But there's also um, restaurants here and around that you can avail yourself of. And your own his and hers slippers. And your own his and hers, uh, you know, dressing gowns there so you could slip on the uh, the dressing gown slip on the slippers and do your best Hugh Hefner impersonation if you wanted to so the bathroom uh, some say the most important room and it's um, big and it's spacious uh, I've already had a shower um, and it was great fantastic pressure great temperature. Let's go and check out the, the bathroom here at La Winter Hotel, jumped in. As you uh, walk in, as I checked into this hotel, the little things that count, towel art with the bath towel. There you go. and the aforementioned shower, and excuse the echo and the sound of the, um, the air conditioner and the demister here as well. But you can see here it's a big shower. You've got the, uh, the two options there, the handheld, and a nice um, big shower head that's stable there as well. Plenty of room in there as well, and I like the tiles. You've got your single basin and vanity with the two glasses there, but it's good, good sized bench. So, you know, plenty of room for uh, your two paste and your other taller trees. So in terms of uh, security and access, it's a key card entry. Um, you've got some uh, technology here you can avail yourself of. And you've got a latch on the door and an old school chain latch. So, you know, with your key card, the lock on the door and the chain latch, you've got uh, your three layers of security, um, as well as your little, um, you know, little peekaboo view there. You can see what's, um, what's outside, who's coming to your door. And if you want to let them in. So I like a compendium to the room. I always uh, review and peruse it whenever I check into a hotel and I've checked into hundreds over the years. And you also like when they have the, the feature dishes. So they're, they're saying here that, um, you know, you got your, your calamari, your chicken curry with roti, your tom yum gun. So, um, you know, you've got some uh, of the signature dishes there for room service. And I'm a bit of a fan of the old room service. Um, there are certain times when you don't want to be out and about. 
and room service can be your friend. So the deep sea opens at 6am and for an early riser like yours truly, I'm a big fan of breakfast open at 6am. A lot of places are not till 8am, some even later. So that's nice. And you've got, um, you know, continental, Asian, American, English breakfast options. And I can tell you that they're reasonably priced. And so are the other meals throughout this um, this little uh, compendium to the room. Burgers, the old club sandwich. Always a winner for room service. And uh, you can see here the other dishes that are, um, you know, that are available. Drinks available as well, and dessert. There you go. Whiskey, some spirits there too. And smoothies, well, there you go. And what's in the bag? Let's find out. It's a hairdryer. Now, for yours truly, that is not an issue. Uh, there's a lot of material to work with in terms of hair drying for yours truly, but um, there you go. Could be of value to some. And it's a Philips. Air conditioning and Wi-Fi are also uh, a very good tick in the box. And I do like this uh, view because it's quite interesting. Uh, you've got your vacant lots here. No doubt there's probably some condominiums going to be constructed there soon. But I like watching the, uh, the ongoings there on the second road and out to the ocean. So just a final pan around the room before we um, step out of the room and have a bit of a look uh, at the features outside. Nice clear TV, as I mentioned, two little uh, areas here. You have your cup of tea there, you can have your breakfast, you've got your little study there. Good, well-spaced, two bedside tables, good size bed, good reception on the TV, and um, you know, very, very spacious um, here in this room. Plenty of storage, good security, and um, you know, a modern, uh, funky kind of feel to this place. Okay, let's step outside and uh, have a look at the uh, grounds and surrounds. And check this out, the pool. We're one floor below it. Just magnificent. Yours truly will be in that pool tomorrow. Uh, probably not today because I uh, had a bit of a big day of transferring hotels and power tourism, but look at that pool. It's long enough uh, to, do some, um, to do some laps, which uh, I probably will do. And you just get a great view out there to the ocean. One of life's great pleasures is staying in a hotel with a rooftop pool and a city view or an ocean view. Here you get a little bit of both. Um, you know, I just love it. It's uh, one of the great things when you stay in a hotel, if it's got a rooftop pool, in my opinion, in my experience and my preference. You've got a little spa section there at the end as well, which is uh, nice for some, if that's your uh, go. Plenty of seating here, uh, over there in like a little club area there. And you've got your uh, recliner seats here. And right next door to the La Winter Hotel is the Rompo Market. So let's head downstairs and have a quick look at the grounds and surrounds.
after one last look out at that view from the pool. That is very, very appetizing, that pool. So we're heading down to the lobby now from the eighth floor where you can find the swimming pool and you can see here it's open early too, 6.30am to 7pm and pool service, great. Nice and spacious lobby area and some big fish there at the front too. So you've got your deep sea restaurant and bar here too at the La Winter Hotel. And uh, yeah, you've got your little side soy here. And you've got a nice little smoker's al fresco area at the front of the hotel, which is nice for some. So Simpson, here's a little side soy here, and over that wall is the Rompo Market. So location is fantastic here. So you've got bars right next door, including the Cronulla Premier's Bar. And on our little walk from the... Uh, Hotel to the to the second road here. Bars, massage places, barbers, nail places, beauty places, uh, and laundry. So there's the second road, and there's a street we just walked um, up as well. And the 7-Eleven, nice and convenient there for you as well, on the same block as your hotel. And here it is, the Rompo Market. You've got the gym there, I've actually worked out in that gym. Nice little corner bar, sports bar there. Lots of bars, restaurants and, uh, and the like here. And excuse the traffic noise folks, but basically through that soy, you will be uh, at the beach here in uh, in Jomtian, there you go. Um. And so we're back in the room now, and the weather has taken a bit of a turn. So I might be taking advantage of that room service here at the La Winter Hotel. Wi-Fi going really well. And there you go folks, a little tour of the grounds, surrounds, and primarily the room here on the seventh floor of the La Winter Hotel in Jomtian. It's a fantastic spot, it really is. Um, mid-range and uh, worth every cent. A fantastic room, great location. Hope you enjoyed the room review and we'll catch you next time on the Coffee Chill channel. Enjoy the balance of your day.